Hello. Hi. How are you? I'm fantastic. Your eyes are not deceiving you. My name is Digital Spectre. I'm back. I've been gone. I've taken a little bit of a hiatus, a uh, step back, a break um, from from doing this kind of thing. I I, uh, I think we all go through, you know, personal things. I tend to get down in the dumps and I don't feel like doing anything. And, uh, you know, I have a, I have a, a son to look after and I kind of want to, you know, I want to be the best version of myself for my son before anything else. You know what I mean? So uh just been kind of taking time to myself not really doing anything i've been drawing more than anything just f for some sort of creative outlet anyhow you know while i wasn't editing videos and things like that and uh you know just to scratch the creative itch uh i've been kind of drawing again lately but um anyhow I'm back, and we're, I'm just going to ease into it. I'm going to play this Maple County Interactive Training Tape. It's like an analog horror style sort of uh, test kind of game, which I've never really played before, and I've always wanted to play one of these kinds of games. And uh, because the analog horror genre is really cool, and I'm you know I'm late to all these parties, though I jump on these bandwagons at at the uh, at the worst times because I'm sure that. By now, you know, the hype has kind of died down around these kinds of things, sort of like the back rooms. I, I, I got into that kind of late as well. But yeah, um, I just kind of want to do something quick and easy. So because I have a huge backlog of, of uh, videos to edit and that stresses me out. So <laughs> we're just going to kick back in and jump back into the swing of things with something easy. So I'm going to stop talking. I ramble too much. Here we go. Let's play. Attention Maple County Police Department. Please take a seat. Your training video will begin momentarily. Already seated. For this interactive training video, please remain seated. <laughs> Pick up the remote on the table in front of you and give inputs when required. Thank you. Remote? He, he likes to breathe. This interactive training video is brought to you by Maple County's Police Department. In this instructional video, you will learn about the current threats sweeping our state. Sounds like a real yourself dude, bro. From this threat. We know very little about this threat, but as we learn and grow our knowledge, this threat will be removed in the following months. Which one are you, The media has not buddy? revealed this threat, and everything you see in this training video is classified. Sharing this information with friends or loved ones is not permitted. Why would they leave something like this up to a police department? <laughs> and not like a three-letter agency. Appear. On instinct alone, okay. please choose the image that is the most unsettling. You will be scored at the end of this video. Okay. Sure, sure, I can do that, I think. Begin exercise. This is cool as hell, though, I will say that. Ugh. This one is definitely <laughs> threatening to me. Are there, like, multiple answers or, like, ways to get different endings? I mean, yeah, I think there's something off about Homeboy here. Kind of looks like a fish. I mean, there's nothing wrong with looking like a fish, but... I'm not... I shouldn't be talking. Yes? Oh. <laughs> Hello. You are not in, uh, in the center of the frame. That's pretty... Th oh, she disappeared. She heard me talking about her. She crawled back under my bed, waiting for to sleep for me to sleep. Ooh, what's that? Floating. Every time I see my old house, I feel sick to my stomach. Ooh, sounds. I like sounds. I can't get his eyes out of my head. He was weightless, almost floating. Yeah, there's definitely something floating here. Is it your sleep paralysis, demon? Dashed from room to room like a puppet on strings. Oh, that's interesting because I've been watching uh, on TikTok. There's these videos of this guy that kind of dances around like a, a marionette, like a puppet basically on strings. It is really creepy and kind of unsettling to look at. It's very cool though. It's real, really well done. I can't think of the name of it. I'll have to find it and share that. I think there's somebody in my kitchen. So why are you typing this out? Definitely. Um. Congratulations. 
You pass the first exercise. Oh, well, that was Next, simple enough. To learn more and how to identify a threat. Your force have identified these characteristics. Uh huh. Lack of emotion and uncanny facial features. Ace that guy. Body language mirroring and verbal imitation. Oh, Lack of God. eye tracking and awkward movement. Unusual. Unusually long limbs. There's a movie coming out. It's like a horror movie called Daddy Long Legs or something like that. I think it's supposed to be kind of in this style. But that picture is that guy. What was that? Dream Valley or something? Dream Survey? Something like that. That um, alternate reality game or whatever. Creepy. Creepy. I think somebody's in my bedroom. Well, they definitely... Uh, well, that, that one girl, she was she looked like she decided to shamble back. Holy shit. Shamble back under the bed. I didn't know there was, like, this kind of shit in this game. Like a fucking walking section? I thought it was just a test. Oh, God. Hello? I uh, have a VCR for eyes. Jesus Christ. That's uh looks like some pizza. That's very cool though. I, thought, I like the I like these overlays. Very and oh oh Yeah, that was definitely What the fuck is happening? Some long legs. Huh? Can you come in my room? Oh you will I'm so sorry, uh Get life alert, bitch, because, uh, fuck that. <laughs> no way. Are you kidding me? Mom is dead. <laughs> yeah, yeah, mom is dead, and I'm not dumb. It is tricking you. No shit. <laughs> the police won't help you. Well, I mean, someone's training. Play dead? Are they bears? Oh, I'm playing dead. No, I don't want to see it. Oh, no, fuck that. <laughs> Holy shit. Hello, Sheriff's Department. Uh, hi. Playing so, dead didn't work. This could be nothing, but there's this really fucking freaky dude that's been chasing my house, I think. <clears throat> well, uh, can you d describe him to me, at least? Um, I mean, I mean it's, it's like pitch black outside, but, um, mm. I, I think he might be on, like, drugs or something. He's moving, like, really weird. <sighs> well, uh, is he doing anything illegal, or... I know, fuck you guys. Fucking nothing happens out here. Just fucking send someone. Jesus fucking... I'm, I'm sorry. I'm just freaked out, man. It's just... <laughs> it never happened. Right, what that was, like, on? good uh, voice no. acting, but then it was just... Fuck. Um... So random. Such a... Such a switch flip. Uh, just, flip switch. Switch flip? Kinda, flip switch. Flip switch. Flip switch. I mean, he definitely knows speak. I'm looking at him. And he knows I'm calling the cops, so hopefully he'll fuck off. But I, I don't know. Something's just... Off. Oh. There's screws in my lap. It's, Where the uh, fuck did these come from? Oh, that's yeah, cool. They kind of hurry. Uh, my mom's passed out in the other room. Tiny I'm screws. Like, wake her up and freak her out of the fucking Daisy head. A lot of my fucking oh, thing. Geez. Is it done? No oh, fucking way. Inspired by the Mandela catalog. Isn't that like the series? That's not a game, right? Son of a bitch! It was so short. That was cool. Holy shit. Uh, man, I would love more of that. What the fuck? I wonder if they're working on it anymore. I'm going to have to look at that. Well, I did say I wanted to ease myself back into it, so... I didn't really get a fucking... chance to fucking... Uh, do a test, you know, really. But I don't know if there's multiple endings or not. I'm not going to go through it. I just kind of wanted that to happen organically, and that's what happened. So, anyhow. Well, yeah. I mean, I guess that was Maple County Interactive Training Tape. I don't think that's what it's called exactly. It's like Maple County Police something. But, yeah, I, I don't know why they would leave something like this if there's, like, alternate people running around trying to mimic and imitate your, you know, people that you know in life just to kill you. And, like, what their ultimate goal is, I don't know. Is it just to take over in general? Like, replace everyone for whatever reason? That's what I kind of like about these analog horrors, though, is that the 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 vague, uh, the vagueness of them. You know, they don't they don't really uh, go into too 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 much detail. It's kind of left up to your own interpretation of things, I guess. 
you can draw these. Uh, I don't think there's any like uh, deeper uh, lore to it. It's just that's scary enough. The thought that you know something out there is mimicking people uh, in your life, uh, just for this express purpose to kill you. You know, it's like that old thing. The Uncanny Valley situation is like something that's ingrained in human DNA that we, uh, you know, we, we have a fear of something like that because back in the day, you know, <laughs> who knows what exactly happened, but we have an inherent fear of something that doesn't exactly look human, but is trying to look human. So it makes you wonder why we have that, uh, why we have that instinct scary scary thoughts you know so if mom decides to uh, run across the house in the middle of the night or you see a very long-legged creature run into mom's bedroom you hear some screaming and then mom asks you to come in because she fell down um maybe just get mom a life alert or maybe just call 911 before you go into the room and help your potentially very injured mother because you know things like this can happen I don't don't do it. don't do that. Don't take my advice. Go help your parents. Chances are they're not skinwalker people or whatever these things are. <laughs> okay, I, I'm done talking. That was fun. Um I've got, you know, videos to edit. I'll be putting them up on the channel. If you missed this kind of thing from yours truly. Here we are again once more. So yeah. Yeah. Uh, Thanks for stopping by. Thanks for watching. Hope you all have a lovely day. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Farewell.